With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So in this question, it is given that we have to calculate standard free energy change for the reaction in which 2Ag plus 2H plus is giving me hydrogen gas and 2Ag plus given E0 Ag plus Ag is equal to 0.8 volt. So to begin with, first what we can do is we can write the reaction which is happening that is 2Ag plus 2H plus is giving me hydrogen gas plus 2Ag plus. So if you see this, Ag is in zero oxidation state initially. It is moved to plus one oxidation state. So this is loss of electron, loss of electron. So this means that it is oxidation which is happening and oxidation happens over anode. Correct. Over here, in this case, the hydrogen is in plus one oxidation state going to elemental state that is zero. So the this is happening. So here, what is happening? It is the gain of electron. So this means that it is reduction which is happening and reduction happens at cathode. So this is the general conclusion which we can make from this reaction which has happened. Now what we can do is we can write the values that is which is given A0 Ag plus Ag is given as to be plus 0.8 volt. But here what is happening the silver is going oxidation. So we have to reverse this order and write this E Ag Ag plus. And that will give us 0.8 volt, negative 0.8 volt. Now we have this, so we can find the value for E cell. So E naught cell will be equal to E anode, E naught anode plus E naught cathode. At anode, silver is there, therefore minus 0.8 volt. Plus at cathode, hydrogen is there, therefore it will be written as 0. So in total, E naught cell will come out to be. 0.8 volt negative okay once we got this we can put this in the formula for standard free energy that is delta g naught is equal to minus n f e naught and here n value is equal to 2 why because ag from elemental state 2 ag from elemental state is going to ag plus and 2 ag plus okay so total of two electron is being involved over here Two electron has been involved therefore the value for n is 2 we can say that delta g naught is equal to minus 2 into f value we know 96 500 into e naught that is minus 0 0.8 once we do the calculation we are going to get the value for delta g naught is equal to 144400 joules to write this in kilojoule we can write this as delta g naught is equal to 154.4 kilo joule so this will be answer in kilojoule. So for this, the option number two is the correct answer. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITG and neat level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.